I'm Owen Matley. I'm Chief Executive at Hertfordshire County Council. Owen, welcome to the uh, Sustainability Conference with Biz Thank for Biz. Um, lots of great businesses from Hertfordshire and beyond here mm. today. Really good to see so many people uh, coming and networking. And it's, and it's great to be out. Uh, we've spent so much of the last two years intensely focused on responding to the pandemic. That's so important now that we can spend time uh, meeting with each other, talking about some of the big issues and opportunities uh, facing Hertfordshire, its residents and its businesses in the coming months. So delighted to be here. Post-pandemic, I'm sure you have a, a very healthy in-tray. Um, mm. How high up on that in-tray is sustainability? Well, it's one of these things that has to become embedded in the DNA of all organisations, all families in the county. It's, uh, it's been on the agenda for a while now, but uh, from COP26 to the need to move to renew renewable energy, there's so many reasons why we just need to boost it even further and make it central to all that we do. It's not quite a standing start, as you say. It's obviously mm. been on the agenda for a wee while. But in Hertfordshire, what, what could we see uh, as businesses and also as, as individual residents? And what, what activities can we see going on that path? So I, I, I'm really pleased to see that uh, the council leader, Richard Roberts, Council Richard Roberts, has set uh, sustainability as one of his three uh, key strategic priorities uh, for the county. Uh, we're not starting from a standing start, as you say. We, the County Council uh, issued its strategy for uh, all things sustainability a couple of years ago. That's divided into three parts. Uh, what we can do to lead and be carbon zero in our own operations. What we can do to enable, looking at our own policies, our own strategies, uh, how we can bake it into that. And what we can do to inspire businesses, individuals, families across the county uh, to do more. So we've made some decent progress, but absolutely the time is to change gear and do, uh, do ever more. We've got a lot of key business people here mm. today uh, from, from this area and, and beyond, and obviously people here as individuals as well. If you could sort of wave that wand, what would you want businesses and individuals in the county to be doing to get on that sort of road to sustainability? So I think there are things that we need to, that need to happen on a national level that government will do. There are things that big organisations need to do, and there are things that everybody needs to do. And so I think if there's one thing we can do, it's to prompt those conversations, prompt those good ideas, uh, prompt those sharing of good practice to say well what can we do from the very small scale up to the massive to to make a difference whether it be on carbon zero reducing waste uh, moving to more renewable energy there's just so much that needs to be done that just getting on and having those conversations I think is the most important thing and just finally there are lots of elements to this as well from a business perspective mm. um, you have uh, you have profit you have social and um, you have a number of different sort of size of things how easy is it for businesses to kind of find their way through to navigate and how would you suggest they do do that? I think it is a challenge because there's so many things to consider these days but increasingly I'm seeing that it's not a stark choice between say profit or sustainability it's it should it needs to become central to how you think about your business model I think there are big opportunities uh, there'll be growth opportunities revenue opportunities but also everybody's involved in a, in a struggle to recruit and retain good people and increasingly I think there'll be an expectation from employees to see well, what is it you're doing in your company to really contribute to this agenda so I think it just needs to be incorporated into all that we do but I do see it as a big opportunity to, uh, to make it in not just a cost or, or a problem.